When creating a manually scheduled task, the first thing is to click underneath the task name, name and type the name of the task. You then enter the duration just by entering the number of days. So if you enter a three, that equals three days. There are other units of duration, such as hours or minutes or weeks or months, but days is by far the most common and recommended. Uh, you'll notice a bar here representing the duration under the calendar or Gantt chart portion of MS project. Um, it defaults to today, no matter what that day is. And the way you can signify, the best way to indicate uh, when the start and finish of this uh, task is with uh, manually scheduled tasks is to grab the bar and just actually move it. For example, if we want it to start on Monday, we can move it there. Uh, let's enter another task, which is create sign graphics and text. This is also three days. And again, we can, let's say we would like this to start Thursday afternoon. Notice that it schedules around the weekend in this case. It's still a three-day duration, Thursday, Friday, and then Monday. Um, if you've forgotten a task, you can insert just uh, right mouse click on the row below, uh, click insert, and then you can insert the new task. This one is one day, uh, and we will grab that, put that on the Thursday, and then maybe move this one to the Friday. Uh, you can also delete uh, tasks just by selecting the task you'd like to delete, right mouse click and delete if you wanted to do that. Thanks for watching.